more go on go on people thems. Uh, so if you've been following for a little bit, like you'll know that I started doing some, well, I've always done some level of movie reactions, uh, but I'm just slower with doing them because like the editing takes a while um, and I'm kept very busy with my music reactions. Um, but I've just started watching the Hunger Games franchise and I've just watched um, the, well, I've watched two of them now, the first one and uh, Catching Fire. Um, and I'm loving both of them. Like, I, I'm, I've really, like, really enjoyed them. Like, more so than I thought, actually. I thought they were going to be pretty... Just a little bit dry. I thought they were going to be a little bit like... I've never seen Twilight, for example. But, like, something just intrinsically in me tells me that it's going to be dry. <laughs> um, but maybe... Maybe it won't be dry. Like, maybe when I watch it. Because I think I probably will watch it at some point. Um, just so I can say I watched it. And I can see what was it actually about. Um, but yeah, the Hunger Games have been very, very good. Very, very, very good. Um, but one of the songs that was on Catching Fire that came up when I was posting on Instagram was a Christina, Christina Aguilera song called We Remain, um, which I'm sure must have played at some point in that movie, but I don't remember it. But as it was playing, I was like, it sounds quite cool, man. So um, I don't think I've reacted to much Christina on the channel. So it's a song I've never heard. So I just want to hear what it's saying. So this is Christina Aguilera singing uh, We Remain from the uh, Hunger Games Catching Fire soundtrack. And I think this is the official video. Yes, Katniss.
Now I can't tell whether that is someone that's put this video together or if that's like an official and again it's not offence to whoever's put it together because it was a lovely like slideshow and everything else but it, it, I don't know whether it was their official I don't know I don't know but anyway <clears throat> lovely little summary really and I literally watched this yesterday so it's nice kind of just, I've seen some of those shots Max oh Max um dude that was sick I think that was such an awesome song like and I think because I used to be like a huge, not used to be like I still am a fan of Christina Aguilera, but I just don't really listen to that much anymore. But like, you know, I was a huge, huge, huge fan. Um, like when Stripped, when the Stripped album came out, um, and and I think it was when I it's then when I started to realise that she's not just like a pop singer. Like she's got her her roots uh, are sewn in like that that R and B. I remember I remember watching her um, singing. Um, I turned to you. Um, and at last, um, at, uh, it was like the male divas version of divas. Um, and, um, she had like a little stint on that and it was just her with a piano and she absolutely killed it. It was amazing. Like absolutely amazing. So I knew from then that she could like sing, sing. This was, this wasn't just your average kind of like, and again, no shade, but. No, she's not Jessica Simpson. Do you know what I mean? She can sing, sing. Um, so, so I've always known she can sing. And that, to me, that song, like, in terms of, again, the pacing of it, um, what it's talking about, like, it, it, it's, it, having watched the film, it fits really well, I think. And I don't know if that this was, like, the main song of the movie, but, um, you know, there were so many bits in that, like, um, like was it Burn Me With Fire or wrap me in fire or something like that like and how she sings that and how she's had that certain growls that she's got going on in there as well like and you know she gets criticized a lot and i've also criticized her a bit as well so i'm i'm, I'm one of them um where the over singing comes in and i never forget that skit in like family guy where they're doing the <laughs> where they're doing her and i think sometimes that can happen with any person that that riffs and runs um but in that song and obviously it's a recording so obviously it's different to how she might sing it live um it was just enough like there was just enough um you know i, I loved how the, the verses were structured i love how the chorus came in um and i, I just love how she sang it i think how she sang it was really really good i love the bridge i love that like really awesome note she hit and um, before the final verse um I just think that was a really, really cool song. I'm really glad I listened to all of it because like, I only heard a snippet of it on Instagram. And I was like, what is this? What's this? Um, and it's a tune. It actually is a tune. And it goes really, really well. Um, so I can see that she's got a live version of this where she sings it with someone called Jackie Lee. I don't know who Jackie Lee is. So um, I kind of... I saw this come up. I saw that come up when I was looking for this one. I was like, mm. I kind of prefer to hear Christina sing it first. Um, and then maybe like listen to whoever this lady is uh, afterwards. So um, so yeah, I'd love to know what you guys thought of this. I really enjoyed it. I think it, it, it hits all the banners that you'd want. To, like like I, I hear that song and I can think of the movie. Do you know what I mean? Which is what you want really. You want a song that, that mirrors that um, in its entirety. And I think she's a, a really, really good job. But yeah, I'd love to know what you thought of this. Um, is that duet with, first off, who is Jackie Lee? Like, does anyone know who Jackie Lee is? Um, and is it worth me watching that? Um, or does she perform, does Christina Aguilera perform this anywhere else live? Just on her own, maybe? Um, but yeah, if you did enjoy this, and do drop me a like and subscribe. That would be awesome. Uh, and again, I do have a Patreon. So if you do want to head over there and show any kind of love to me and the channel, that would be amazing. And you get access to a lot of things early and stuff. So uh, it's definitely uh, definitely worth you coming on over. So yeah, for now though, thank you so much for watching with me. And I hope to see you on the next one. <laughs>